They've had to race at every point to cram in as much of the latest tech as possible. Android got dual cameras in 2014. Apple didn't introduce them till 2016. Android got wireless charging as early as 2013. Apple didn't bring it in till 2017. Androids have always had millions of customization options. Whereas for the longest time with an iPhone, you'd have one choice. What wallpaper do you want? The list goes on, but the point is that Apple wasn't caught up in this rush. Apple was very aware that they had such a loyal fan base that they didn't need to compete with Android, but more just with themselves. They realized very early on that there's only so many things you can add to a bar smartphone like this before either the average user just can't tell the difference or the extra cost from those additional features actually makes the phone less desirable. Like there's only so good you can make the camera before the bigger bottleneck actually becomes the person taking the shot. There's only so fast you can make it such that everything you want to do is already buttery smooth.